One of the hottest topics in nutrition right now is, should I follow the ketogenic diet? Well, first of all, what is the ketogenic diet? This is when you deprive your body of carbohydrates so that your body has to switch from using sugar from carbs as fuel to ketones, which are produced by when your body uses stored fat as fuel. And this typically happens over two to four days of consuming around 20 to 50 grams of carbohydrates per day, which is about one and a half cups of brown rice. So does keto help you lose weight? Many people go to the ketogenic diet for a weight loss solution. Keto is when you cut out all carbs, sugar, fruits, and most vegetables. And setting restrictions on the food types that you eat in turn causes you to eat a lot less calories and a little bit of a temporary solution to a sugar addiction. Some evidence states that weight loss is faster on a ketogenic or very low carbohydrate diet compared to a low fat diet or even a Mediterranean diet. But over time, these differences seem to disappear, especially when calories are matched. So what are the benefits of a ketogenic diet? Well, with an emphasis on higher protein and higher fat, you do feel full and satiated for longer. And by cutting out completely sugars, you have less of a sugar craving too. And this in turn helps you eat less calories. What are the risks of a ketogenic diet? Well, although it can be a quick kickstart to a weight loss journey, there are not enough longer term scientific studies to determine if keto is effective and healthy for weight loss and maintaining weight loss. Because some of the staples in this diet are meats, eggs, processed meats, sausages, cheeses, oils, butters, nuts, seeds, you definitely lack nutrients that you would normally get in a diet filled with whole grains, fruits, and vegetables. Worse effects can occur on the liver and kidneys as a result of a high protein diet, and this diet may cause nausea, vomiting, and sleep problems if you enter ketoacidosis. And then there are also unstudied effects on blood sugar, diabetes, and cholesterol. So before starting a diet, definitely consult your doctor to see if it would be right for you. In summary, although a ketogenic diet may accelerate weight loss for those willing to maintain it, it is very hard to sustain and is heavy on processed saturated fats and animal proteins, which have been linked to poor health risks such as cardiovascular disease and some cancers study after study. There's also no long-term research on the associations with ketogenic diet and health. So yes, it may help you lose weight, but it might not be healthy for you depending on what you decide to switch carbohydrates out with. For instance, if you try to replace fruits and vegetables with bacon instead of nuts and avocados, you might experience some health risks. It's also important to note that yo-yo dieting, which causes rapid fluctuations in weight, is associated with all-cause mortality. So instead of focusing on a fad diet that usually lasts weeks or months, try to focus on a sustainable, nutrient-dense, whole food focused, balanced diet, such as that recommended by Harvard Medical School's healthy eating guidelines that we follow here at Chandelier. Coupled with a regular physical activity routine, this has the best evidence for improving and maintaining health and a weight controlled life.